Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel, PH Born, U.S. Naturalized. We have Jess here today and she has some things she wants to tell you. What are you going to tell us today, Jess? 12 things that I miss about America when mm -hmm. living in the Philippines. I still like it here. This is in no particular order. Okay. Number one, food. Dunkin' food. Donuts, the you, food. You don't eat here? No. <laughs> These are the foods that I cannot find here. So, food. I miss the Dunkin' Donuts, sesame bagel with cream cheese and jelly. And I miss IHOP spun cake mm. with unlimited syrup. <laughs> the syrup is just there on the table and then you just have to get how much you want. I miss that. Number two, the big servings of food. <laughs> you go to a restaurant, you have this big serving of food. Okay, I will have a box so that I can eat it later in the house. That's the second. Number three, shopping. I love shopping in Walmart. What, you don't shop in the Philippines? Oh, I do, <laughs> but these are the stores that I'm passionate about. My happiness is very shallow. Walmart. We have the self-checkout counter. I love the mazes. I can go around mazes a whole day. I miss the TJ Maxx, the Marshall, the Ross. All my really good things. <laughs> I miss those stores. The next, number four. Oh, the number three. Return and exchange policy. Oh, yeah. really? Yeah, you... you you come home and you're excited with the dress and then you put it on and oh wow, I look like nice here. So you return it back to them wow. and they're going to take it in. Nothing like here in the <laughs> Philippines. <laughs> All right. Next, the clean air. Wonderful. It seems like you go out of the house in your neighborhood and you can just, you can even taste it. You can even feel it. The air is so clean. It's not clean here? Oh, no. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Where our house is clean, but you go out there. Okay. But I still have it here. Okay. <laughs> Next, the four season. You know? You know what I love about the four season? I can wear different oh. kinds of clothing and different kinds of footwear, you know? And then you will see in springtime, you will see the budding flowers coming up. And in autumn, you will see the red, the yellow, the gold leaves, nothing like that. And in winter, you need to see the, the whole thing covered with a white snow. Although the summer here is like here, <laughs> but I still get to wear flip-flops in summer, all right? So I miss the four seasons. Okay, the I four seasons. Like all right, next, <laughs> the service area. You go on a road trip, oh. <laughs> you travel, okay, you can stop at the service area. It's cool. You got everything you need there. You can gas up, you can eat, you know, you can go and uh, you can go and pick up some little stuff like, oh, you want some chips, you want some peanuts, you want some ice cream. I love it there. And you can even relax and rest for a while, rest for a while before you move on with your destination service area baby you will find it here mm -hmm. but i still like it here but they do have places for buses to stop yeah for buses to stop and does it feels like the same in the service oh, no. area there mm -hmm. for buses to stop but what if we have we're in our private cars you know which we don't have i believe but i still love the service area okay what else okay. all right next the bathrooms <laughs> The bathrooms? Yeah. I love the bathrooms. You can flush the, the toilet, you know. There are paper towels. There's toilet paper. You have the soap there. And just, it's really very nice, you know. You don't have to squat or you don't have to pick up the pail and the bucket and then you flush it. It's wonderful, baby. Mm. Aside from that, our house is there. We have a tub. A bath tub in your bathroom. Isn't that cool? I only see that in the movies, you know? <laughs> <laughs> so my life in America is like, whoa, watching all the movies I've watched. All right, so, so much for that. Let's move on. 
cashless transactions. Oh. You swipe with your card, even a cup of coffee. You don't have to carry around cash, you know? That's what they have in America. Although here, they still have a couple there that accept it, but amazingly or surprisingly, there are even big restaurants that we already lined up to get our food, and then when you arrive there in the cash register, they will say, cash only, like, what? So you have to look for an ATM. America, cashless. You can go with that. All right, next. Customer service. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you call on the phone or there's a counter there, customer service. They help. They help. They help. Yeah, they help. What you need, you know, what you complain. Not even complain, we don't complain. But if you need help, they really need help. Whether it's on the phone or whether there's a counter in the store, they help. Hmm. That's what I love about the customer service there. Next. Number. Number. 11. Oh, 11 already? Yeah. Wow. Safety first. <laughs> you walk in the morning, like the two of us, we're older people, you know. You won't even be bothered by, oh, this is an, an, an uneven pavement. I'm going to slip, I'm going to fall, I'm going to trip. Nothing like that. So you don't go up and down in the pavement. You don't, you know. So it's safe, you know. And even the streets in the neighborhood, it's safe. The pavement is the same. That's what I like there, you know? And it's just wonderful to walk. Not like here, that you have to go up, down, and you bump your head in this very low awnings, you know? And they don't even take responsibility for that. But anyway... <laughs> no one to sue. You no know one to sue. <laughs> uh, anyway, I still like it here. Because yeah. there are different countries, you know? All right. And I'm going to go to the last, which is... Number 12, the health care. Oh. The health insurance. Yeah, there. You have Medicare, you have Medicaid. We take care of your appointments, you know, who's doctor to see where you have to go. And we just only have, if it's big ones, you only have to pay copay. Yeah, I miss that. You know, here, we don't have that, but there's a hospital that we can go there, but you, you are like grouping in the dark, like who's the best doctor that can, something like that. So America, you have a health insurance. And when we go to America, we can avail of it. But here, we pay in our pocket, from our pocket. But I still like it here. Hmm. All right, Mark, those are the 12 <coughs> things that I miss in America. How about you, sweetheart? What did you miss in America? You are born in England, you are raised up in America, all your life you were in America, except for those trips that you did when you were little. Okay, what did you miss? Hmm. Well, I miss my kids. Oh, Mark missed his kids. How many do you have? Well, I only have seven. Okay, only yeah. seven. Yeah. And what else? Well, I missed fishing. Oh. And the streams and the lakes. It's so oh. easy to fish in America. Right, right, right. And surprisingly, we don't find it here, you know, the oh. lakes, the streams. Or if we do, there's nothing there. They did not put some <laughs> fish. Some fishes there. Or they so, took them all out is what happened. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they got them all. They're eating them all. <laughs> all, right. all right, guys. That's my 12 things that I miss. I still like it here. And two from Mark. Yeah. All right. I hope you understand thank my you, feelings. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much. And please subscribe if you are still with me at this point. Maybe you like this video. Bye. Bye.